You marry the love of your life and you live happily ever after, right? No. If you've been married for more than a couple of years, you know that this is complete and utter bullshit. A loving and connected marriage requires time, effort, and focus, and a high value man knows this. Unfortunately for most men though, it only takes a few years of marriage to leave them feeling disillusioned and disconnected from the wife with no idea why. If you're feeling disconnected from your wife, I guarantee you there's three behaviors that you're exhibiting in your marriage. And today I'm gonna to be sharing with you these three behaviors that high value men never do. And be sure to stick around to the end of this video where I'm gonna share with you five tips to reconnect with your wife. Now with all that being said, let's dive right in. Number one, a high value man never makes work his number one priority. A high value man gets a great sense of significance for how he shows up at home for his kids, spending all the quality time with his kids, and also for how he can connect with his wife. He's deeply connected with her, they share everything, and they're on the same page. So he doesn't go looking for to meet his need for significance just through work, which is what most men do. They know how to succeed at work, but they don't know how to succeed at home. A high value man knows how to succeed at home and in work. And because a high value man is physically and emotionally available, Available for his family, it creates an incredibly tight bond and a really strong family unit. Number two, a high value man never loses his cool during an argument with his wife. So he does have conflict every now with his wife. It's completely normal in a healthy relationship with the ups and downs in life, but he never loses his cool with his wife. He understands that by rate and getting angry, it means she needs help. She's overwhelmed and she doesn't know how to communicate effectively like him. So when she gets angry, he regulates his emotions, stays calm, and then has a communication skill set to dig deeper into what's really going on for her. He doesn't try to fix her issues straight away. He looks to empathize and understand what's going on for her. And this allows them to create a really strong connection with, with one another because his wife feels like she's understood. Now, what most men tend to do is when their wife gets irate is they kind of back off is one case. They can shut off altogether, uh, stonewall their wife because they don't know how to deal with that kind of with their emotions. Or they can go the other way, which is a, what a lot of men do is they'll get aggressive and they're being defensive. They go on the attack and this just gets their wife to shut down and cause a lot of disconnect. Basically what's going on here guys, in your relationship, if you're having a lot of arguments with your wife and you're not resolving them together, what's happening is the emotional safety is being eroded in your relationship. And emotional safety is what is the backbone for every relationship. It allows you guys to communicate openly and to have that feeling of connection that you're on the same page. So if you're currently feeling disconnected from your wife, I guarantee you the emotional safety needs to be rebuilt. And number three, high value men never seek attention from other women. So there there are times in a marriage where things can get tough and you can have your ups and your downs but a high value man when he notices that things are going a little bit south with his wife he knows it's time that they need to allocate more time to the relationship that needs to be more focused on the relationship he doesn't decide to disconnect and go do other hobbies or spend more time looking for attention from other women he knows that his attention needs to go to his wife and rebuilding and strengthening the relationship now this is unfortunately a mistake that not only men but also women can make in marriages is that when they ha hit a bit of a rough patch is they can end up trying to form an emotional connection with a co-worker the opposite sex and they talk more with them than with their spouse and this is horrendous because it's the first step towards then a full-blown affair if you find yourself struggling in your marriage it's time to double down you can reconnect with your wife by following the tips of my videos don't be going to look for attention from elsewhere it's not going to help you it might look like the grass is greener on the other side it's not that person also has their own shit you just don't see it you need to focus on your marriage remember your vows remember your kids and work on creating this intimate relationship with your wife, a much stronger relationship that you could have with anyone else. So you now know the three behaviors that you should never do in your marriage. You need to watch this next video on the five tips to reconnect with your wife.